Yo, what up, what up, everybody? Uh, it's Fuego Beats back again. Uh, another installment of uh, what pisses me off. Um, haven't done a, a rant in a, a while, but stuff is starting to get on my nerves. Uh, one thing in particular is uh, stuck-up females. Okay, not just females, but anybody. But in this installment, I want to talk about stuck-up females. Okay, for one, one question I have is, why are females stuck up? Okay, most of the time it's because all of us dudes gas them the hell up. Okay, so one, we need to stop doing that. Stop the gassing. Okay, another thing I want to ask them is, why the hell are you stuck up? Okay, especially when you ain't shit. You could, you live with your parents in a basement or in another room. You can't even cook without asking. Young ass is 30, 31 years old and you still. Live with your people, okay? And you got the nerve to be stuck up. How are you stuck up? What the hell is there to be stuck up about? What do you have? Okay, A, you're driving a used car. You're not doing shit. You work at a dead-end job. You live with your parents, as I mentioned. So how do you have the audacity to be stuck up? And then... And then when asked a question and you say that you don't pay attention to people, when somebody asks, let me let me break down. Somebody asks you, hey, have you talked to so-and-so or do you know so-and-so? And you have the audacity. I don't, I mean, I don't even know what other word to use, but you get on your pedestal or whatever and you say, nah, I don't talk, I don't know, or I don't pay attention to people. Unless they're important. Who the hell are you to say who's important? Because you damn sure aren't important. That pisses me off. Okay? None of this is, is, is really cool. And it's not a good look. But it's definitely not a good look, as I said, when you ain't got shit. So the key to this video is you ain't got shit. You do not have shit. You are not accomplishing shit. Shit is at the fucking meat of the damn message, <laughs> okay? Because that's what it is. I'm not saying you could be stuck up if you have shit. All I'm saying is you ain't got shit, so you damn sure can't be stuck up. There's no reason to be stuck up when you don't have nothing going for you like that, okay? I'm not saying you can't have nothing going for you, but you just don't right now, okay? There's nothing going on. You're living like a 15-year-old teenager. And and <laughs> that's not a good look when you can actually, when you're old enough to have a teenage son or daughter. It's not a good look for you to be acting like that. Okay? It's time to grow up. It's time to stop acting stuck up because you ain't no better than nobody. Okay? Whether you're black, white, pink, or, ye or yellow, <laughs> you're not better than anybody. Okay? So just understand that. So y'all ladies that's stuck up, your head is in the cloud, you think people are stalking you, so you have to, you know, make fake Facebook names and bullshit like that. Yo, ain't nobody stalking you, okay? You have a vagina. That's what men like. You can look like the chick from Precious, and dudes will still holler at you. You can look like J-Lo, and dudes still will holler at you. It doesn't matter, okay? So you're not special because when the dude can't get butt from you and she can't get butt from your sister, your cousin, your best friend, he's going that way. So it's not you being special like I'm this special person so everybody wants to talk to me and everybody wants to look at No, they want to get at you for butt. They don't care that you're you. They don't care who you are. You're just a female with a particular organ that they want and that's that. So stop the stuck upness. There's no reason to act stuck up. Okay, every dude ain't trying to holler at you. Okay, it's not happening. I'm married, so I damn sure ain't trying to holler at you. But most ain't. If you could be in a crowded club or a crowded restaurant and no dudes come up to you and you alone, that tells you something. Again, you ain't shit. That is actually, again, in the sentence. So as I said, the subject, the meat, the freaking... Common denominator is shit, okay? <laughs> and you got to realize that you ain't that, okay? So step it up. 
become some shit, do something, and maybe you will be singled out as, hey, you know what, I rock with that person, or you know what, that person deserves to be a little, you know, full of themselves a little bit. I don't think you should be stuck up, no matter who you are or what you got, but real talk, at least if you got something, you got the right to walk with a different swag or, or something like that. But as I said, if you're in a crowded spot, restaurant, club, grocery store, walking down the block, and ain't no dude trying to say nothing to you, they don't even give you a time of day, understand that you're not shit. So if you need me to break it down to you, I will give classes. Uh, you just need to come to the DMV area, uh, and that's uh, D.C., Maryland, Virginia area. Uh, classes are fifty dollars a class. Uh, we talk for two hours about how you can become shit because at this point you ain't shit, and you just have to understand. So hit me up, Mr. Fuego Beats at gmail.com. Hit the website up, fuegobeats.com, and uh, check my man Profit out too, cause he got some shit to say. I'm out. One.